dog food blend is uh, pork loin, chicken legs with bones, duck neck, carrots, apple, green tripe, fresh green tripe, um, uh, uh, a green tripe blend mixed with um, uh, organ meats, and um, a few hot dogs thrown in for taste, and then, you know, salt and some turmeric, mm -hmm. and there will be some yogurt in here, and eggs. So quite a bit of stuff, but, um, you know, dogs love it, it's, it's good for them. Sometimes, uh, if we're, you know, low on money, we will buy a kibble, and we'll mix it like in with kibble, and help save money a little bit, and then, you know, the dogs still get some good stuff to eat. Good, so this is what it looks like. We all grind all the meat and mix it all together. Okay. As, yep. Very good. Hot dogs. done and we're just adding some spices just salt and a little bit of pepper and we're gonna put turmeric in here mm -hmm. yeah turmeric is really good it helps for the inflammation for the doggy turmeric it's a lot of ground meat and yep we're adding salmon oil Squirts. About 20, huh? 28? Oh, 28 squirt. That's a lot. Good. Yeah, just wait a second. Okay. Here's the yogurt. We add yogurt to it. It looks yummy, huh? <laughs> Squeeze. No, oh, everything. Good food for the dogs. And it lasts for about couple weeks, huh? No. Oh, for a week? week? This might last a week if we mix it with, uh... Yeah. You know what else I need? Mm-hmm. I need one more green tripe, package of green tripe out of there. Okay. So we add more tripe. There you go, more tripe. It's a lot. And then we're gonna put it on a gallon bag, Ziploc bag. Two bags. Yeah, two gallons bag. There they get chicken and some green tripe mm -hmm. and sometimes beef if we have beef mm -hmm. but beef is really expensive and um, it just is whatever meat is on sale organ mm -hmm. meats mm -hmm. you know yeah. but generally uh, it's whole chicken leg yeah chicken leg and this one we'll, we'll mix it with their dry food for breakfast yeah. the thing with the green tripe that's good is uh, it's really good be because it has a lot of really great bacteria left over from the cow's gut stomach because mm -hmm. it's from their tummy. Uh, I forgot which one tummy it's from. There's four or five of them, but people say that it does the bacteria doesn't survive oxygen and that it doesn't survive the freezing. But there's been studies done on it that show that the bacteria does survive about 40 percent of it, which is flipping lot and so if you mix it in here 
It's true there is bad bacteria in here, but there's a ton of good bacteria in here now when you mix all this green tripe in here. Mm -hmm. And it, we've been feeding our dogs this way for like 11 or 12 years. Never had a sick dog yet from eating this stuff. In fact, our dogs' coats are great. They don't have allergies. Um, sometimes when we feed them cheapy foods, kibbles, they can get allergies a little bit, but then we'll get off of it and on to a different kibble. It's not good to feed your dogs the same thing their whole life because then their body develops all these problems related to being fed one style of food their entire life. Really, you don't want to do that. I mean, would you eat uh, Captain Crunch your entire life? You know, if it had a few extra vitamins in it and someone told you it was good for you. So basically, you want to rotate their foods to give them the best possible gut bacteria. That's what will keep their, their allergies down and their um, hay fever, you know, paws, hot spots, itchy paws, uh, ear infections, those are all immune system related and it's all related to what you feed them. So here's, uh, so here's the taste test. This will tell you whether the dog is gonna eat this food or not. Let's find out. Noble, sit, sit. Oh, he's a good boy. Oh. Oh, he's a good boy. Pooches, come here. Oh, look, Noble wants There's more. There's Pooches. It's a princess. I like it so far. Come and here, Prince Pooches. Sit. Sit. Oh, oh. Yum. Oh, that's good, huh? Oh, my goodness, yes. Oh, that's our big dogs. Oh, those guys are going nuts. Mm -hmm. Oh, you like it? Yes. Very good. Very nice. So I score two for the English Mastiff team. Mm -hmm. I better let Sugar have a little or she'll be upset. <laughs> oh, yeah, Sugar got finger. one too. Oh, she takes <laughs> it so they can't get it. Yeah. All right, yeah. close the door. Ooh, it's no, so no, cold no, up there. No, no, no more. Down, down, go see. No. <laughs> I think it will Yeah, now. you didn't see the they puppies here because they're still in their kennel we're gonna let them in about okay. 7 30. can we pack this up now and then we'll show them what it's like when it's all packed yeah two gallon bag here's the um bag of it finished product finished product so we already put it on a ziploc bag so this one pack can last for about two to three days well it depends if we also give it for the puppy they can have a little bit, sort of about maybe two days. So we make about two, five batches. So it's good for about 10 to 12 days. So, yeah. and it's good and healthy for them. She's our princess. <laughs> you princess, she's our sweetheart. Yeah, like she wants to shake hands. <laughs> good girl. Good girl, princess. Oh, look how she wants his tail. It's our gentle giants. It's like a baby. Hmm? Hi, Nobs. He's a big boy, too. Hmm? <laughs> he wants love. You're too big for mommy. You're too heavy. You're too heavy. Hmm? <laughs> so, Ayan, you see how we made our um, dog food. So, hope you enjoyed our videos and thanks for watching. See ya, babu.